guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new here welcome lovely don't forget to like subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified on every new upload and also follow me on my social medias to interact more and for my french speaker bienvenue sur ma chaîne et surtout n'oubliez pas de liker s'abonner mes loulous now let's get back to work hey guys how you doing I got it again with another video <laughs> anyways I was showing you my nails right now because I'm about to do my right hand and that Savillain pulley gel wasn't budging since I had to take it off off camera it took me too damn long <laughs> excuse my French but yeah I have to take it off and I was like time for a new manicure honey manicure okay <laughs> but yeah I'm applying the Vaffy pulley gel today and temperature temperature oh excuse me changing color <laughs> so yeah i was pretty excited i am using the gray and the violet i call it purple but they say violet tomato tomato you know <laughs> anyways that's what i'm using and i'm capping it with the clear i am using some tips the stiletto tips because I didn't want to use the you know the nail foam today yeah I didn't see the needs to I just wanted something new I've been using poly gel with nail foams I mean nail dual foams a lot so yeah I just wanted something new something a little bit more yeah that's what I do I do the same stuff I usually do you know put the nail primer and after buffing of course you guys i buff and clean my natural nail bed and buff the inside of my tips yes that's how i do and then i glue it with some cheap glue that works super fine for me i really like i'm sorry i can't remember where i got it from but yeah i really love that glue that's what i do apply the base coat and we'll be ready for the application sis So this first color is the violet it changed i mean violet aka purple <laughs> but it's a really dark purple i really love that color and yeah what i did was the same way we always apply the poly gel honey we went we already had the base flash cured it in 30 minutes in the big lamp then yeah i start working i used once again the two bead method you know I'm trying to work on that to see how perfect I can get at it but yeah that's what I do I just go in and you know start to build my nail up and make sure it's even all over the the finger and I know they're pretty long they are pretty long I shouldn't have done it this long <laughs> but yeah that's what I did my mistake but anyways that's a bad yeah it wasn't a complicated process it was just lengthy because I had to take my time because once again I was going in for a glittery fall I would say autumn look to match my uh, my left hand and you can you can catch my video uh, of the application on my left hand I posted previously so yeah you can see how I did with some nail forms and acrylic <laughs> but that's what i do i go in i apply the poly gel i put the glitters and i cap it i cap it with my savillain clear poly gel because the vaffy one was a little bit too hard on my taste and i couldn't really walk walk it around like i wanted to and it wasn't you know so i was like i'm just going with the you know the savillain i really like this one better that's what i do i flash curve it so i don't have to go too much in the big nail lamp and that's that's what I do the whole video you guys I use two different colors like I said the violet and the gray one that's the color I really like in the um, in the kit and yeah it matched the vibe that I wanted to have right now you know the autumn vibe so that's what I did and I'm gonna let you watch it wasn't complicated it's it's a really easy process 
just like applying it on the dual form and putting on your finger just with a tip that's about it you guys with some glitter and capping just like that so i'm gonna let you enjoy it and coming in out just in case you need me or not <laughs> anyways i'll see you soon
but yeah that was about it afterwards i make sure everything is cured nicely and i clean with some alcohol pad the sticky layer of the poly gel you always need to clean it you guys otherwise it's going to be a big mess so i clean everything to start getting ready to file you know i didn't have a lot of filing to do just make sure the side walls are crisp because this uh, this application went in smoothly you guys i was very happy i'm making sure everything is size the same but i always make my right hand a little bit shorter just the thumb that's the length the length here the longest <laughs> whatever <laughs> whatever jelly you want to use you guys anyways i make sure everything is smooth crisp so i can put it on the top coat and get the life going you know because <laughs> the mom is busy and this kid's waiting even though we have to stay on point you know what i'm saying <laughs> anyways that's what i do i just smooth everything i didn't want to buff you know buff i'm sorry i am tired you guys <laughs> i didn't want to buff with the uh with the buffer so i just used the a file first make sure everything is smooth so i can do the rest and, you know on my own terms so that's what i do I didn't didn't fight for that long just made sure everything was crisp this the uh cuticle area was smooth and that was about it that wasn't complicated at all you guys but i just wanted to show the colors these two colors were my favorite in the kids oh my god so pretty so pretty that's all i have to say but anyways that's all i did and yeah that was about it <laughs> So yeah, I'm putting in the top coat that come with the kids because yeah, I gotta use the whole kit. But then I had to go in with, you know, on the side with some Savilene diamond top coat because I really love the top coat. It is very shiny. So I put some on top of it, but yeah, it wasn't a big deal to make it shinier, you know. But that's all I did, and then I just put some cuticle coal. Oh, this was going to kill me. <laughs> some cuticle oil on my cuticles and massage it good, and I was good to go. Those nails are still on. I did them, I think, last week, and you guys, they're holding on tight. You know what I'm saying? Like my edge control is holding on my edges. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. That's all I did and I was good to go.
ahead and pour some you know hot water in the in the glass and try to show you how the temperature is changing you know because i couldn't show it with the 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 nail uv nail lamp so yeah i was really happy with the results it came out beautifully i had some uh nail decals on it the butterfly but it didn't record it so i am sorry but yeah that was about it so you guys thank you very much for being here and i love you see you soon bye